All right, welcome back, everybody. We are here for some Super Mario 64 randomizer with angles, so take it away. Thank you so much. Uh, welcome, everybody. We're gonna have some fun today. First of all, this screen needs to be shown because otherwise, it is not the random seed, it is the side, it is then a set seed according to the rules. But yeah, we are gonna jump in. I'm gonna explain a little bit about what's hap what we're gonna see is randomized once we get in because. It is much easier to see exactly what it is then. So I'm gonna start us off in 3, 2, 1, let's go! So first of all, we don't have to worry about Lacky 2, he's not gonna bother us here. We're gonna start with going to Bomb on Battlefield. There are technically two, another one we could start with, but this is the quickest one uh, to start. Okay, so... First of all, it's random stages, so uh, we are starting with Lethal Lava Land, and uh, that is a very lucky start, <laughs> the, the fact that we got that star there. That star symbolizes the star that is behind the big cage over there, so pretty good one to start with. And as you see, we get speeded out from Lethal Lava Land, so we are then in uh, Big Boy's Haunt instead. Big Boss Haunt is not one of the best, so we're gonna see if we quickly can find a good star in there. Uh, otherwise, we're just gonna leave and uh, head back into Leaf of Lava Land. Oh, hi there! You decided to come up late. <laughs> this is the Big Boo that is on the top of the mansion normally. And uh, that's not too bad of a of, uh, location for it. So we're gonna roll with it. So there are a few more set things that is randomized that you guys will see uh, once we get back into the different worlds. Oh, there we have the naked one. And yeah, those ones are how dubbed as naked. The ones that is just out. We don't have to do anything to spawn them, basically. That is very lucky as well. And that ghost is normally also somewhere else. Everything that gets random is still in this loading zone. So for the best example I have for that is uh, in Kulko Mountain, which is the first snow level. The star, the star in that one cannot be inside of the actual slide. It has to be somewhere out, out uh, in open. It can be near the penguin. It can be on top. It could be in the wall jump section. As long as it's, it stay, it's still in, in, in its, in its vanilla area, if you could like that. And where is the final of that one? There it is. And this one symbolizes the secrets. And that is a very vanilla location for that one. That is wonderful. Yeah, objective as it says there, it, it is 30 stars we need to get. It is a, a, it is a ROM hack, absolutely. Every randomizer and that sort of stuff is handled inside of the ROM. Okay. Hazy Maze Cave is also a pretty good one. Oh, it seems like we are unlucky with not having any stars down here, and it, it is a pain to head back up. So we're just gonna check uh, the metal cap one instead. And hope we get a better one next time. Oh, we have Rainbow Ride over there. That is not a nice one for us because this is honestly quite a good stage. So the fact that it is behind that is the metal cap one, it is not as great. <laughs> into Rainbow Ride and see what that is. And that is Aquarium, we are not gonna do that one. And now we're gonna see the another thing that is randomized as well. 
every time we enter a level, we are gonna have a random spot we start out with, so it is a lot of adaptability you have to have in this randomizer. That was a good spawn for that. The other one in there seems to be a little bit higher up. Um, let's check that one. And that is not a good one as well. We are not gonna do that. And that is a vanilla stage as we call them. Vanilla is when something is exactly but it has been randomized, but it still is the same as it normally is. And we're not gonna do that this time because those red, those red coins are much harder to get when they can be anywhere. And I'm not the best flyer. So yeah, we are not gonna bother with that. Oh, there it is. <laughs> exactly, that is a phrase that we usually use. Is it even randomized? <laughs> we unfortunately don't have too many options right now, so we're gonna go back into this one. Look, trying to look for. Uh, the big guy, but we can't seem to find him, so we have to go head back down into the basement again to get that guy. I think we just pushed him through the door. And it's also random every time you spawn these stars as well. So they can... Sometimes you, you kill that dude to see where it is. And you decide if you want to do it or not. A little bit close there for me falling down. Yeah, this ghost can be on the other side of uh, the courtyard. So we're gonna try to find the, the yellow box star that is normally on top of the mountain. Okay, it's not down there. Okay, we're gonna pivot to red coins instead. And you see, the coins are also a little bit misplaced. Oops. Okay, I guess we're not gonna go for that. <laughs> I'm gonna take up here then to start with this time around. Okay. Not the star here, so that's good. Okay, now we get to see what this loading zone takes us. That takes us back to Bomb Bomb Battlefield. Oh, we have a star over there.
Oh, we're gonna leave uh, the last star, the last leave basement for now and do some other stuff, I reckon. Because I don't quite like the other things down there. And uh, nope, I will not take another death for that. Yeah, the, all of these doors also have uh, random uh, star counts, so uh, yeah, this one could have well, well have had 16 stars to get into. Okay, is this a quick one? Yes, that was uh, one out of two ones. There are two yellow boxes in this one. So we are trying to find the the one so you can have a good uh, circle of uh, ones. Um, sure, because I really want because so uh, Rainbow Ride is a really good place. Okay, we're gonna check the box first. Nope, it doesn't have any. Yeah, there's one box star in there out of a lot. <laughs> And we got a vanilla course again. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> so we're gonna stay here for a little while now. Because uh, TikTok Clock is also one of the better. Let's move away from him before he throws us. Uh, it didn't seem like it was anything downwards. Here we go. Have another vanilla situation. We're getting a good mix of spawns actually in this one. Seems like most of the stars are far down. Not a lot of top stars today. Well, if there is there any other questions you guys want, let's ask the way because, uh, yep, we are just gonna start away on the stars here in TikTok clock for a while now. We have one star left in here to, to collect. Yeah, normally I really like spawning up high because they tend to be at least one star up there, but not today it seems like. I actually didn't know that, that is a very interesting fact. There was, a, there was someone uh, on talking about uh, a very cool fact about the skybox in wet dry world in my in my own chat so that's something um my favorite stage is probably rainbow road just because of uh so of, uh, it is a very cool speed run run one there's a lot of cool little tricks you can do in there 
Ooh, Womp Fortress. Womp Fortress is the best one in a randomizer because it is very small and uh, it is full of uh, the naked stars as, as they have been dubbed. Okay, so I have a few more stages that we would want to find because, uh, yeah, they are good. Oh, peace slide, let's go. We are, f are gonna go for the box one because that one is that one is somewhere on the track. We're just gonna have to find it. It is far down. So if we, if we come back to this one, we are gonna do uh, that cool trick to get uh, up there, basically. Like, to get uh, get the skip in the slide. Are we gonna do it later? Okay, we have the star over there. Best song is Super Mario 64. Um, I honestly really like the 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 Bowser fight songs. Uh, they are pretty good. Alright, let's do the slide then. Okay, quickly, get in the time you think I'm gonna get. I think we're gonna head down to the basement just a little quickie because there's also a little type of rabbit that we're gonna try to catch. Oh, that was just... Uh, oops. <laughs> Okay, I guess we're not getting that one. <laughs> I have actually never had him spawned up there before, so I didn't know how to handle that. We are 14. That was good, Lemiron. And unfortunately, we, we do not. Doesn't seem like we will find Tony in this one. <laughs> he said the thing. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, where do you have the box in this one? Yeah. 
Where is it? I can't seem to find it. Okay, I guess we go for uh, for uh, the bigger bomb then. We're gonna do a little ill action now, I reckon. Because Cest is really bad in uh, the randomizer. It can be, uh, you have to go in and out of this cave a lot, a lot, a lot of times, so we're just gonna get the eel out and then we're gonna do that star. <laughs> yeah, that that eel is not uh, is uh, quite scary. I agree. Yeah, absolutely. I agree with the OT one as well. <laughs> they are not the nicest. We are not gonna do that either. Oops. About to go the wrong way. That would have been irritating if I accidentally had landed on that. Just to quickly say that as well as I saw that question earlier, a randomizer is also everything is shuffled, so you don't know where everything is. Every time you en you enter the game, this this everything is everything is placed different, so you have to adapt and try to route your way to quickest beat the game. 
that way. And this just happened to be the quickest way today. <laughs> Going rapidly in and out of uh, that one. Should be one more uh, star of that one in there somewhere. The placement of the star has been good in this seed. The thing that has not been as great have been uh, what the stages have been. Alright, we are about to get our final star, then we are off to Bowser. One thing that is changed in this as well, except for the randomizer here, is that uh, the count we have set it, which is the third, 30 star, is not on the stairs leading up to the final boat to say. It's, instead, it is placed on the door, so you can't get through the door without getting the required stars. That has been set according to the category you are playing. Uh, where do we have the final one? I actually can't see it. Yep, you can't uh, shake your way up those stairs, unfortunately. <laughs> or fortunately, depending on who you ask. Okay, we are gonna go for another one because I can't seem to find that star, some, the last star in Rainbow Ride. But there's still some great uh, stages left that we haven't discovered yet. Like that one! All right, let's get going to Bowser. And we do not get to do a little death abuse because if you spawn far enough down, it is just better to uh, take a death and uh, hope for a better spawn position. We are just not getting that today, all right then. Let's go for free or free. Come on! <laughs> wow, there's only we will be able to get some thirty as well. So let's do that. Mm. 
And that is an immediate no. There we go. Here we go. The time is about to come up. As soon as I collect this toy. Yep, that is a quote, everybody. <laughs> Time. Alright, a pretty good one. A little bit unlucky where these courses were where, but that's fine. Yeah, thank, thank you so much, everybody, for uh, uh, letting me uh, level uh, coming and show, seeing this, basically. Thanks so much to. Uh, Striper and the team for letting me put this on for you guys. Well, it was a pleasure to have you. Uh, do you have any information as to where people can find this randomizer? Yes, there are a dedicated Discord to it, so you just search for that on Google and you can find a Discord where you can get all the resources. Otherwise, you can also head over to speedruns.com and actually search for Super Mario 64 Rando there, and there are a resource tab for that as well there. You have to get your own uh, ROM though, they are not distributed in the ROM, you have to decomp it, basically. Of course, you must have <laughs> your own, uh, ver uh, you know, uh, very own copy of Super Mario 64 uh, in order to be able to generate uh, this randomizer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but thank you very much, it was very uh, fun to watch. Uh, but don't go anywhere, folks, we're going to be right back with Dying Keto doing a berserk boy any percent <laughs> <laughs> 